Neighbors want to put the brakes on a proposed gas station, one that some fear will turn into a truck stop. It's happening in Delaware County on US 23, just north of Delaware. And that's where ABC 6's Tom Bosco is live tonight. Tom? Yeah, Bob, this gas station I'm standing at here at 23 and Hills Miller Road appears to be out of business, but another one could be coming just up the highway. It would be huge and would dwarf this former mom and pop. Trucks barrel south toward the city of Delaware on busy US 23. Highway traffic from the north is slowing for just the second traffic light since the Michigan border. Seems like a good spot for a gas station. Or so think the developers who bought 13 acres this past May for $225,000. I got a hold of the traffic study they put together for the city of Delaware. They're proposing a speedway here with 17 pumps. 14 for cars, three for semis. It would have two driveways, one from southbound 23, the other on Hills Miller Road. Not so fast, say neighbors. I think of noise. I think of uh, odor. I think of like a full-time 24-7 noise. Jack McGrail and his wife live nearby and say the project has been described to them as a truck stop. They say the area is already too busy, and what's more, it's home to wetlands. One is directly in the middle of the 13 acres. The city of Delaware denies that it's a truck stop, saying there'd be no showers or overnight parking. What's more, the traffic study hasn't been approved, and the plan could still be revised. Still, neighbors want to red light the project. I understand the need for something like this, but this is not the place for something like this. All right, so what are opponents doing about it? Well, the McGrails organized a town hall meeting to talk about it. Susan McGrail was passing out these flyers all day trying to get folks to this meeting and uh, raise a little bit more opposition to this project. That meeting is later this month. For now, reporting live outside Delaware, I'm Tom Bosco, ABC 6 News.